Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Yoshi's Island. I like pots and ghosts. Welcome to ghosts. Looks like we're going to be finishing off World 2 today. Oh, other than the super secret bonus level that everyone knows about. What? No, that doesn't exist. Don't be silly. <laughs> yeah, what was I thinking? That's going to be a fun one. <laughs> so, these pegs. I don't like them. They yeah, look a little I don't blame precarious. You. Guess what? <laughs> and shouldn't they be they, like... They don't actually sink. I don't think wood can survive. I don't think wood can survive magma. Well, that's true, but I'm a little more angry that they actually don't fall into the lava. I spent a lot of failed recordings uh -huh. assuming that they did fall into the lava <laughs> when the game was kind of just trolling me about it. Well, yeah, the real danger is just, like, landing on it. Yep. Especially when you think that it's going to sink in the lava, so you jump off it every three seconds, thus <laughs> killing yourself repeatedly. Right. Um, didn't you see the warning? This game uses psychology. It plays you just as much as you play it. It really it's does. Very this sneaky. thing is like Silent Hill Shattered Memories or something. That was a joke. <laughs> so was that. Oop. These, I take it, do actually fall. They do. Oh, God. And speaking of dick moves... Oh, spikes. yes. I do remember these. <laughs> Not fondly, mind these you. These things are one-hit kills. Because, you know, this game just loves making Yoshi invincible for everything except certain things. <laughs> the whole Mega Man Divine philosophy, spikes are the ultimate weapon. They're pointy. Yoshi doesn't like pointy things very much. He also doesn't like hot things very much. Well... Who? Neither do I. <laughs> Spiky things and hot things, like, no. I, mean, I guess it kind of depends on what kind of hot things. Well, I'm assuming we're talking magma kind of things. That's, Spiky yeah, magma. Okay. <laughs> By the way, none of those coins down there are like red coins or anything like that, so it's really just pick Completely one of three paths useless. and hope that you get the, uh. Just, or hope that you get the flower. Well, I guess the Pachinko School of Game Design. Mm hmm So, of course, just when I get through telling you that almost none of these coins are useful either, there's a bunch of red ones hidden in there, but that's it. It actually reminds me. By the way, I love this castle background. Oh yeah, it's really cool. But just in Super Mario Sunshine, things. there is a shine sprite in, like, Delfino Plaza or something where you have to play a pachinko game, and it is the worst thing! Wow, really? <laughs> Yes, That's... I remember that one. Oh god. Ooh, ooh, this is the best room without question. Oh, the ghost just bombed the shit out of you. Well, this is that's, that's this is the reason why it's the best room ever. Because you can make these shy guys preemptively drop the bomb by ground pounding before like while they're still passing it around to each other also like fake flowers. <laughs> but But they look so mad. I... You could never fall for that. This is a happy game. Yeah, I, I love all the faces they make. Yep, when when one of them drops it, they they become very sad, and all the other ones shame him publicly, and it's awesome. What are you doing, man? <laughs> Wait, how do they make faces? with it. How do they make faces when they're like masks? <laughs> they're very know. good masks. Also, if he lets go of it before you. Uh do that, like, before you can ground pound it off of him, then he also shakes his head, but if he drops it, <laughs> no. shame. Oh, and the guy next, and, like, and the guy next to him is yep. really confused. The guy who's supposed to expect it gets confused, too. It's, like, That's amazing! The There's so much thing. detail in this thing. <laughs> like, someone spent so much time with this little thing, and it's just so adorable. It is so adorable, yeah. Well, whoever did that, I appreciate it, and I appreciate you. By the way, the flower that I got right in this spot here, what you're supposed to do is let the shy guys, like, you know, fall on it, but or drop a bomb on it, but why would I do that when I have eggs? Eh, just angle the bomb, it's not that hard. The flowers respawn and I don't like that. Can you ever truly kill a flower? Sure. Yes. It's gonna definitely go with yes there. But will it not live on in your heart? Well, no, no, not if I stepped on it. Maybe on the bottom of my shoe, but then eventually it'll fall off. How morbid. Mm. That 
It's oh, I, I remember these morbid. in a different game. Yeah, they're pretty similar, actually. Just arts and crafts in a different way. Big and spiky and unpleasant. Mm-hmm. Except this time you don't get to stand on a clock to move them up. By the way, the room with the shy guys and the bombs and stuff, that wasn't optional. If you take that path first, guess where you're going. Go back. <laughs> this castle has like a bunch of branches in it, and so much of it is just stuff like this. Or I even better, sewers. stuff where if you go the wrong direction, then you could just end up locked out of an area, and you'll miss out on whatever's behind door number one here. That is literally the worst thing in video games. Oh, oh, the the bashless. They were guarding a flower. How cute. They weren't very good guards. Oh, no. They don't have Not at arms! All. <laughs> well, <laughs> How can you guard things without arms? Why do they get hired? That's a very good question. Kamek is not very good at this. Yeah. Okay, I, I can accept that I mean, that I as assume answer. this is back when, when the whole, before the whole Bowser Syndicate kind of got rolling. It would just take whoever would walk in the door, which I guess is why they have so many shy guys. Oh yeah, because they can spawn infinitely. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. It was like, hey, I have a billion cousins in this warp pipe. Yeah, you know, quantity, not quality. <laughs> Oh, and all of my dead relatives also have their own warp pipes, but only in caves. But they supply their own infinite bombs. <laughs> yes. Law of probability dictates that one of us will succeed. <laughs> yeah, I guess when you have infinite shy guys, it's like... only a matter mm -hmm. of time. Uh, speaking of things that suck, not that we were... More spikes. <laughs> And spinny platforms, it's ridiculous. Well, shy guys suck at their jobs. Oh, well there we go. See, I was on top of Is there not the anything time. in that yellow area? Or that The yellow stuff is actually like jello that you get like Yoshi's head caught in, and half the time when I was trying to show that off, I would bump into either the flower or the instant death spike, or like like the evil flower, the instant death spike that was in there. Huh. <laughs> yeah, this game is I don't uh, remember that at all. This game is getting mm -hmm. hardcore. Yep, speaking of hardcore, yeah, is, I hate this room so much. It's messing with you a lot more. It, that's, that is a trend that is going to continue. So yeah, we want to get through that door. Um, much like the last key that we had, had to find. There, It's it's hidden in a uh, vase. The only thing about that vase is that... Oh, it's is that it just got stolen. And there are like six vases in this room. <laughs> you have to keep going in and out of things. And yeah, that too. And getting chased by bandits. Uh... Well, think of it this way. At least it doesn't phase in and out when they go in. Oh, God. <laughs> I'm not sure the game could handle that. I'm not sure we could handle that. That's also true. Nope, not that one. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's at least all. Hey, no. Oh. Die, you son of a bitch. Oh, God. Oh, God. That had been like a second more than we would yeah, have been able had to get it from the middle ring. Yeah. And that just would have been shameful. Oh, there we. No, don't go away like that. Yeah, I don't want to deal please. with these guys anymore, please. This is, yeah, this is a pretty mean room. Mm hmm. <laughs> seems largely also, by accident. I have accident. no idea what the point of this is. Absolutely none. That seems like a good place to hide a, uh, a coin or a flower. Like anything, right? Yeah, or some red, nope, or some red coins. Like I said, psychology. <laughs> Double reverse I think psychology. I already collected all of the items. Psychology's a terrible and powerful force that can't be used- that can't be misused for evil. Wait, didn't you that just hit a, a ring? Yes, yes I did. Okay, Yoshi Island. <laughs> well, I think they expected you to just have jumped straight for the ring as soon as you saw it, so it was, it was really more of a mercy thing. Man, yeah, there sure are a lot point. of pots in this castle. I wonder if that's like foreshadowing or anything. <laughs> Probably not. We already saw oh. the level name. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> oh, I guess the boss is a pot. Well, if that spawned you like a couple inches to the left, <laughs> straight to game over. So, is does Kamek have like limited precognition or something, or does he just like see that baby and freak out and it's like, oh my god, that is such bad news? 
Well, he's a wi he's a wizard. What, like, wizards can can do anything they want. Okay, so they. But he's such a bad wizard. <laughs> well, I didn't say with the I didn't say he was ghosts, good They've uh, built a better boo because I can't actually hurt him with eggs. This, the only this thing is, a... is that he's this... kind of stuck in a pot. This boss is, like is a weird because it's like it's so dumb it kind of wraps around to being great. <laughs> it really does. It's amazing. Especially because someone had to animate those shy guys pushing for their lives. Yeah, that's part of the great. Is that like <laughs> they're trying really hard? I love shy guys. They're so what? cute. There is the other. And I also like this guy's facial expressions. Yes, he's adorable. He's also kind of he he like looks behind him whenever you're pushing him off the ledge, and he goes like, "Uh oh, I better I better take care of this." <laughs> It's a weird boss. Game has some weird, weird boss. bosses. It's in, it's in, it's inventive. I'll give it that. That's that's what I love about this you game. Know, they not, were just trying. It, like every single level has something new in it, even if it's a ghost and a it's pot. It's not hit the thing and hit the red spot three times and then you win. Mm-hmm. It's it really like it's it's not a hard boss to be honest, but. It's still, like, such a great example of why this game is awesome. Oh, extra two OP'd. OP'd? Yeah, a little bit of a typo. No worries. Has that been there the Extra whole... two is so OP. Nerf Blizzard, please. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, extra two is pretty OP. Let's, oh. let's not talk about that until next time, though. Oh, yeah. I'm sure this will be fun. <laughs> Does it play Terran? Mmm, Probably. Because it is far and away the most OP race. I unfortunately don't know enough about StarCraft to keep that going. Well, we've finally blown up a second castle, and the world theme is starting to get pretty rockin' right now, so I'm just gonna listen to that. Sorry, I'm dancing, I can't talk now. Oh, I thought, I, I thought we were like... Supposed there is nothing that needs to be said. I thought I was supposed to be quiet for that part. <laughs> well, we are kind of just being quiet for that part, but... But, but then, then Adder ruined it. Uh-huh! Thanks.